Food, music, and a whole lot of fun with neighbors and around our community are on tap this week. If you are still looking for some great celebrations to enjoy as summer is winding down here, James Ty is back with us today. How are you? Wonderful. Good. I'm and feeling very short next to you today. You're sitting oh, over sorry. Really it's just okay. relaxed back like this, maybe. How are you? Great. You had a big weekend. A lot going on. Yes. Um, but moving forward, some wonderful opportunities, especially to get out and enjoy food. We're going to start with an event Whole Foods is hosting on Wednesday. Yeah, it's called Burgers for Barks. It's a great event going on. You ever like want to go out to dinner with your pet? This is it. So you actually can go down to Whole Foods this Wednesday. With your pet. You can bring your dog. Don't, there's no food for cats, but there's actually sure. <laughs> they've got burgers and ice cream actually for dogs and actually got burgers and ice cream for, for adults. Also, you ever like, go to the grocery store and they've got those great burgers, maybe in the meat section with all the great toppings and things like that. So you're going to have lots of different choices, beer from Potosi uh, Brewing Company. So a wonderful afternoon and raising money for Dane County, County Humane Society. Society. Very nice. So head down to Whole Foods. So that's at Whole, Whole Foods, Foods, University Avenue. On Wednesday. On Thursday. I don't live mm. far from here. I'm going to need to get down mm. to the park. Yes. This is at Lake Wingra. This is, this is a wonderful Wingra thing. Lake Wingra, Wingra Park right off of Knickerbocker there and Monroe <laughs> Street. This is actually for $3 if you bring your own canoe, kayak, or paddleboard. You actually are going to go out, paddle out onto the lake. Just $3? For $3. Well, wow. if you bring your own. They also have them for rental, too. You can rent you know, the boats or anything like that. But basically, for $3, you're going to paddle onto the lake. They're going to give you a spoon. You're going to arrive at the first station. They're going to give you a bowl. You're going to put ice cream in there. You're going to go to another station. They're going to put toppings on there. So it's... It's actually called, as, as we said, the ice cream boat float. So it's a great thing going on this Thursday. And what a neat thing to do with your kids. There are so yeah. many great ways. They do such a good job over there at Wingra Boat. So. Maybe I'll do two laps. <laughs> you wouldn't be alone. And then the whole weekend, Orton Park Festival. Is, this is such a neat yes. event. Unbelievable talent in from all over the country. Exactly. A huge music festival going on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday and Sunday. So it's actually a four-day event. Got some cool things going on, but one thing that I saw that's really neat is actually having a, a dance performance going on for two of the nights, uh, Thursday and Friday, and they actually have stilt walkers, people hanging, doing somersaults from the trees, all sorts of wonderful things going on. That's 745 on Thursday, and then it's a little bit later on Friday, and that's free and open to the public. So they're on these big oak trees, and they've got all things going on. So it's going to be really interesting. It's one of Madison's oldest parks. So lots of things, all we can, including a cakewalk. You know, got to get that food thing back in there. I know, and, and I'm, I'm getting a wrap, but we have a Monroe Street food tour that's happening on Sundays, 1230. Uh, I'll try and post something online. Yeah, you go to Orange Street and and find out more information. Check it out. Okay, James, great to see you. My Thanks pleasure. so much for coming back in. A final check on traffic and your forecast when we come back.